Good morning, uh, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and let's talk some boxing-related shit here. Uh, first off, congratulations to, uh, or should I say thank you to the boxing gods, and, you know, we've been blessed with some good fights, you know, Nicholas Walters and Vasily Lomachenko. Which, uh, you know, I like Walters a lot, but uh, I'm ha- I'm going to have to go with Lomachenko. And believe me, this is going to be, uh, no pun intended, but a whitewash. <laughs> now, on to the subject of uh, just just some frustration on my behalf, okay? Now, I try to be fair on this channel. And I say a lot of shit that, uh, you know, I regret sometimes. But, you know, this video is going to be me 100%. Everything that comes out of my mouth is staying on here. And this is the way I feel. I'm a frustrated boxing fan, okay? Now, Manny Pacquiao and Tyson Fury, just get the fuck up out this sport, all right? If you want to act like kids, if you want to do cocaine... Heroin, crack, uh, you know, go down fucking Baltimore City and get yourself a fucking bag. But stay the fuck up out of boxing, please. It's a grown man sport. And it's a serious sport. So, you know, like I said, if, if you want to do this childish bullshit, just get the fuck up out of boxing. Period. Now, I thought it was common knowledge that Manny Pacquiao had done drugs, you know? And I'm not a fanboy, okay? Uh, I don't talk about Golovkin because I'm not with his bullshit, you know? Uh, yeah, he fought Kell Brook, you know? And Cal Brook has a marvelous record of beating bums in his country and hijacking that fucking title and ducking people in his own weight class and then fighting Golovkin because he can, uh, you know, take that L, fuck around, come back down. You, you know the bullshit that we deal with as boxing fans, you know? So that's why I'm glad about the Lomachenko fight, the Walters fight. Hopefully Golovkin gets a real test against Danny Jacobs, a real middleweight. And then we'll see what he's got. Because, you know, I'm tired of the world-famous uh, bum show that he's putting on, of knocking out bums. And I do understand that, yes, a lot of these fighters are ducking you. But, you know, you got to try a little bit better if they're ducking you than having Tom Loeffler and Abel Sanchez speak for you. Uh, what else? We got some, you know, hopefully the boxing guys do bless us again with... Uh, could you please cut that off? Excuse me, people. <clears throat> Hopefully the boxing gods bless us again with uh, Klitschko and Anthony Joshua. And forgive me, but uh, I don't follow the heavyweights too much because... You know, Klitschko was a horrible, boring fighter. And uh, I know, you know, shout out to Jay Cotto. And he likes Klitschko. That's cool. But I, I, he ain't my uh, type of fighter. I was turned off when, uh, you know, he hugged. I forgot to fight. But he was fighting someone, and, you know, he hugged him so much he should have been disqualified. But when you fight in your backyard or at the O2 Arena, and 
you know, it's your show. That's what happens. So, you know, Manny Pacquiao, get the fuck out the sport. Uh, it's been great watching you. Um, but, you know, enough with the childish bullshit now. And Tyson Fury, really, he's the one that needs to get the fuck up out of here. Uh, yeah, and and I said this three months ago. You can go back, check on my channel. I said that Tyson Fury was on cocaine when he jumped in the ring with Deontay Wilder. So, uh, I just wanted to touch base. Um, oh, shit. I almost forgot. Uh, Orlando Salido. And I, I don't want to butcher the Japanese man's name. Uh, Takashi Mura, I believe it is. Um, I don't know if you've seen the fight or not, but him against Francisco Vargas is just, you know, an excellent, excellent war. And Salido and him is going to be a, a war, too. I wouldn't count on seeing too much uh, grade A boxing skill. But if you want to see two fighters with no defense, just slug it the fuck out, you're going to see that. And, of course, Salido's in the fight, so you will see low blows, head butts that he counts as, like he likes to say, they're punches. Uh, this is JR, the Boxing Junkie. I'm out.